all right but yeah this could be yep yeah. so somebody has to choose between their somebody has to choose between like their current could be their third party again like i said um or and 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 somebody from their past whoever this person whoever this other person is i'm guessing yeah whoever's in this page energy that wants to outpour okay let me let me slow down somebody's in the paid energy it could be another it could be a water sign it doesn't have to be cancer Pisces, scorpio but this is somebody who's feeling this energy really really heavy okay and um yeah somebody used their intuition to guide them through this energy but either way either way there's a decision to be made somebody could be, could have been at a crossroads so i don't know if you, if you did a crossroad candle good for you because you're returning back to your roots here somebody's definitely returning back to their roots because their intuition is on point but i do see that somebody had to make a decision between two people and somebody's really emotional it's a lot going on oh i just realized i didn't even fucking finish guys my bad i got i'm a little stoned if you know what i mean i didn't want to say that but i know y'all feel me but yeah guys yeah there could have been some sort of temporary hardship and now it's because of bad intentions and all that but that was a hard stop there yeah they had their chance and look god is good God is good. Your ancestors took care of that. That's it. Somebody could have Scorpio placements. Okay. Let me see. Now, who is the Nine of Wands, please? Let's clean up the energy. Wow, guys. This is like way longer than planned. I do apologize, but Spirit had to get out today. Let's see. Oh, let's see. Uh, Nine of Wands. Nine of Wands. Okay, so let's let's find out who, who was the Nine of Wands. Tell us the Nine of Wands. Yep. Somebody who's a juggler. Could be somebody at your second job somebody that only has a part-time job you could have met them at your second job definitely could be a um this could be you and your business or could be you trying to save like do different gigs could be you juggling somebody juggling two people here as well yeah definitely yep trying to play the other one like a fool that's for sure again that's the fire sign energy aries leo sagittarius doesn't have to be them but it could be you or them doesn't have to be but i'm just saying this is the one that has the hater oh Okay, so they, they tap into your passions. And I feel like in order... Yeah, because... Okay, so in order for... Yeah, okay. So the thing about this is, right? Whoever this king, like king of... Um, or I'm sorry, not king. See, they think they're a king, but they ain't not a king. They in knight's energy. So they need... They got some growing to do. They're, they're a little bit slow moving. Like, they might be passionate about the connection, but they don't do shit about it, right? That's the kind of energy that this is. Yeah, because they're always... They're very resilient of the connection that you share with them. Yeah, because they must have been hurt by other people before. But, like, how many times... But you don't deserve that. Like, somebody is on pause here from working with you or working with their spirit team. Yeah, somebody is paused from trying to do some fucking work with another person, whether it be physical people or their team here, because that's a missed opportunity on this. Ooh, they missed their fucking opportunity and you're about to get an unexpected windfall of gifts, bitch, from the universe because you've been soul searching. There could be a Virgo or somebody that, I'm telling you, dog, whoever really ghosted you or you ghosted them, they really want to give you some money. Like, they really want to buy you a house. Like, it's like that. If you know this person can afford it, it's like that. I'm letting you know right now. Because they really like... See, they like to fucking pull their energy back to be in control because they're very resilient of how they feel. But you got to stand your... See, look, stand your, your ground with this person. You see what I'm saying? Stand your ground with this person. Because you are guided on what to do. You see what I'm saying? I, like I said, heavy Virgo energy, you were guided. And after you stood your ground, you leveled up to the Empress energy here. Yeah, because these different friendships and everything, news traveled very fast to you about these different losses. People were really like, not themselves. They were being used, if you know what I mean. Okay, um, but I definitely see that you have some foresight on this person. So whoever this, um, whoever this player energy is, the person that could be juggling, yep, person that could very well be juggling two people. This person could even like, they could even have an apartment for this. For some of you guys, this person has an apartment for this other. Like for some of you guys, this masculine has an apartment for this girl. Like, it's like that. They could stay together for some of you guys. Somebody could stay upstairs. I saw some stairs. There's some stairs involved here. But either way, like this person is ascending, but I don't think, they, they I don't know. I feel like, 
they still play the fool with themselves, but your intuition is too strong. You know, you could, I feel like you must get different dreams and download, but definitely heavy on the dreams. So write your dreams down in a journal. Yeah, but there's somebody. Oh, so there's two people. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. So they're backpedaling. They're back. So this is what happens. So they got, oh, I see. So they, they must have gotten foresight that you're no longer in the full energy. Like you're not a fool. Whoever this person was, they try to juggle you potentially. And they wanted you to be a fool. They thought that they always have these promises of like something new, something new. Like, oh, I'm working on something for you. But it never came through. Something like that. Could have been this financial support. For some of you guys, this person was supposed to give you financial support or, or vice versa. And it just didn't work out or... I don't know. This could even be the person that you're dealing with now. Uh, I don't know. Take it for resonance, but this could be somebody that you're dealing with now, like their old person. I don't know. But either way it goes, like this person could be their old person, something like that. Listen, all I know is somebody's really worried about the divine masculine. And they, shit, for some of you guys, this person wants your divine masculine to be single. Shit. Like, bitch. Damn near willing to pay their ass. I'm just seeing that. That's so funny. They could even be willing to pay this person. They're so desperate for your masculine. That's crazy. They're such a hater that they want to be like you. Oh my God. I don't want to be in this energy anymore. Either way it goes, I know that, bitch, you about to get some good news, some swift news. You might even get like a text message. Somebody, you're definitely going to get something in the wind. <sighs> Pay attention to the birds, how they're responding. Pay attention to like the crickets. Listen to everything outside, you know. Stare at things for a while, you know. See what you see. Yeah. Because that relationship is widening open so like definitely your relationship with spirit um the, the relationship that you have with yourself the relationship that you have with your higher self is very important here yeah because these fake smiles could never but yeah that's the past and i feel like things different things popped up on you from your honestly like this somebody from your past again i don't know if i said this earlier could be trying to pop up on you yeah or this could be somebody for some of you guys this is a past life lover take where it resonates okay but either way you're about to get good swift news about something okay but yeah somebody had a vision about this person somebody had a vision so this person was juggling you you might have been telling yourself that they weren't but then this is the fire sign i'm finishing up i know i'm all over the place but it's a lot of energy and i need y'all to know everything i want to make sure i don't miss any of the messages y'all um because it's not mine to hold you know it's you know it's from the spirit so you played innocent with this person you gave this person their freedom you know what i'm saying like, they really tried to play you like a fool. But anyway, they really didn't know that that was a test for them. And they failed. Okay? So now they're fucking trying to move forward towards you now. Now they're they're really in their head and their thoughts. Trying to talk to spirit. All, now they're trying to talk to spirit. Yeah, look. And they're it's crazy what's going on here. Yeah. Yeah, everything's really routine for them. They have a choice. See, they had a, cho a choice to fulfill. And the choice that they take is easy. They want everything to be easy, okay? Now, who is this Knight of Swords? Okay, hold on, let me fix this. Yeah, but that wish fulfillment, yeah. Woo! Your intuition is growing fucking far and fast. You're getting different, Um, I feel like some of you guys could be getting different gifts that you didn't know you had. You know, shit, it could even be gifts that you denied yourself, like said you didn't have. You told yourself, like, nah, I'm just tripping. Are you? Right. So once you once you form a better routine, it's like you must be forming a better routine to connect with your foresight. Now, I know this is about the person, but this is for you guys. Like, I feel like you guys also could be because I feel like this person, like if this is you, though, take it where it resonates. This could also be you. But either way, it's like it's a lot of choices going on. But like I said, this person really thought that you didn't have foresight. They thought you were a fool. They thought you were just playing. Some of you guys could have told this person that you that you have gifts and maybe they tried to play you but it was never that they tried to play you because they can never play you but like baby you <laughs> gonna get and that's that's the that's part of the test here for you guys for all of us i meant for the collective stay strong but they could have really thought that your shit was immature oh and they found out because they understood that your routine is 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 heavy commitment like you see because you must come from a bloodline you know that has a lot of commitment to the routines that they do that also Again, manifest. There we go, spirit. Come on, spirit is working right now. That also manifests, like we were saying earlier, that manifests into um, 
routine that that that, that manifests into different magic things like that's different magic things manifested though whichever way you want to take it here or there everywhere there's a lot of dimensions and when i speak i speak on different dimensions so please forgive me sometimes i pick first of all i want to have the right word for y'all for y'all to to make sure that i'm delivering the message in, in god's way um of course and then it's like i want to make sure that i'm making sense and also i want to make sure i'm within guidelines that's the main thing too if you know what I mean. But guys, this is some heavy level information here. Somebody is being blocked, though, from making this choice between you and, and somebody else. I don't know if they're in a relationship. Child, somebody want to outpour into this relationship now. I don't, Y'all, bye. Why don't they get the fuck out your energy? This person thought they wanted to be a player. Yep. And now, they're, now you're getting recognition in the ethers. You know, in the cosmos. And <laughs> all of a sudden, they want to recognize you. Or, and then for some of you guys, this person might be winning. They might be getting some different accomplishments. But without you, they're like, oh my God, I have nothing. And that's why they're all missing you. It is cold outside. Okay. Yeah. Bye. Off of them. But either way it goes, you're going to get recognition off of this because you handled the situation really well. So the, uh, like, spirit team, like, for real, the other side, they're watching you. They're watching all of us, but they're, anyway. You pass the test on this person. Make sure that you keep them out of your energy. That's, you know. All right, block them if you have to. You see what I'm saying? I, I do shit like that. If I know that I cannot speak to this person, block them. Because even if you have them under, or don't answer. If you have enough willpower to do, don't answer. But I, I just block them so that they have no way to call me. Because I don't even want to get nosy one day and answer a do, don't answer. You know what I mean? I'm not going to do that, God willing. But, you know, I'm just thinking about, thinking back to a couple of years ago. Like, maybe when I first started ascending. You know, God is good and has blessed me and my loved ones all my that's all of us really i'm just sharing so that you guys can know like it's normal it's okay because of yeah i found that important to to know that i wasn't the only one going through my spiritual awakening so but yeah when that stuff first started happening i damn near lost my thought guys but i hope y'all caught it i hope i made my motherfucking <laughs> my mission i hope i made it make sense okay but you're getting a lot of um, a lot of advantages here. Yeah, so you keeping this person out is part of your, your soul contract as well. Okay, so who is this Knight of Swords? This could be Air Sign, uh, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini. Ooh, so what? They don't want to be single anymore? Because if they got the Nine of Coins, that could mean that somebody is not single for some of you guys. Um, mm, yeah. Hmm. This is somebody, this Knight of Swords is somebody who doesn't follow through with their word. They're in the page energy here. Yeah, and somebody knows this. You guys already know. Yep, you already know this. This, whoever this is, has a lot of anxiety and they... Hard for them to sleep at night. Right? They also need to, if this is your friend or something, tell them to ask for their angels for help. That y'all can connect through that if that's what you're led to do you know you can help this person if you, if you feel like you have the capacity to do so um yeah this person is not stable they could be in a trickster energy um either that or either that or there could be somebody watching you projecting this energy onto this person let me clarify clarify the magician please because thank you yeah ten of cups hmm yeah this who is this because this could really very well be somebody that they used to be like married to bitch or it could be somebody that they that your person used to go with what either you or your person here i'm strongly feeling like your person for some reason yeah because it's in the knight of swords i mean this really could be you like i said you know we did say that earlier because there's no gender this could be you now all i know if this is you you got to be more direct with the with what you want. If you don't, oh, somebody, somebody wants to be, somebody could even want to be single and they're not, or somebody could not want to be single anymore. I don't know if there's if. It, so this person must be okay. This is really fucking toxic, and I hate that I even have to go here. But for some of you guys, this is the person that acting like they want to be single, but they really don't, and they're not saying that. Um, and they're acting like they have everything within their own selves, but really they want a family and a marriage. Cause look, we got marriage right there. Look with the 10 of cups. This could also be your, um, ancestors working this out here, putting this together. Um, but either way this goes, um, 
with the lover, like with the love type of person, I would say that's a no-go because this person could be creating an, illu an illusion through their money. They're faking like they're like they this person can really fake like they got money, but they don't. Or they're like an overspender, or they could very well be a fucking divinity. Ooh, for a lot of you guys, this is somebody who sorry, I got so excited. This is somebody who um is a spiritual bankrupt person. You know what I mean? Yes. Definitely. Yeah, because this reader, whoever this fucking fake, look at that. That's right there. Thank you, divination abuser. That's because this also means terror reader. Terror reader could mean it. Like, definitely, it means that. And this also, or it could be like a mentor. It could even be a mentor or something like that. Come on now. With that nine of swords, it's like they're being tormented by whatever they thought was going to you. They didn't do it right. They didn't do it right. So, thank you, God. But either way, yeah, somebody is trying to. Tr Child, I know they wasn't trying to send no tricks with their spirit, with their um, ancestors. Like, child, please. Either way, they invested into anxiety, okay? They could actually try to summon that thing up, to be really honest. But yeah, you have a lot of... This person tried to take your... Wow, they, they tried to take your destiny. But they didn't know that karmic justice was on the way for the Queen of Cups. Yes, because you're in the Queen of Cups energy. Definitely. Yes, justice is served on that ass. I told you, thank you so much, spirit. Because that was a karmic test for this person. There we go. Finally, we're to the other end. Because I was like, yo, I hope I can. I had to make this make sense. So it was a lot going on. But y'all feel what I'm saying, right? Yeah. Because this Knight of Cups is... Aw. Yep. So that's what I'm saying. Whatever this connection is, like, there definitely was conflict. If, if you guys don't have this right now, it's it's coming. I'm going to be really, you know, when you come to Jane Page, I'm going to be honest. Listen, whoever this person that you're with, y'all going to have little conflicts. There is going to be, because I have to understand, there is going to be people, I hate to say it like this, but I just need to warn you. It's like, okay, don't be, okay, let me say different words then. How about this? Do your best to understand that everything manifests different ways you know we transmute ed energy different ways so when it comes from the 6d and 5d and things and you know things of that nature and it comes down to the 3d i'm just saying it clearly because i want to make sure you guys are catching what i'm saying listen when it comes down to the 3d right it's going to look however it looks it's going to come essentially through a filter through your filter your your own like energy filter right so it's going to look like different things You following me? All right. Right. That's what I mean. So that's what the spirit means when they say things like, okay, it, things, what I said that it transmutes, the energy transmutes, you know, that like blends in, you know, transmute is like basically like blended in, you know, kind of like an artist, you know what I'm saying? Artist of your kind. So whatever type of art you like to do, lean into that more. That's part of your self-love for a lot of y'all. A lot of you guys are really sleeping on the booth in the studio. I don't know if you're a rapper, writer, singer. You could even be a dancer, bitch. You could be a painter. Or this could be something that you want to do as a hobby. Hobbies are very important. Like grounding. Hobbies are super important to keep your mind off of work because you got to have that work-life balance. So take yourself on dates. Go on dates. Have fun. Let yourself live a good life as long as you're not harming anyone, including yourself or your children or your family or anyone that you love, you know? Just anyone. You know what I mean? And take care of yourself. Do a little self-love. Okay? Um, but you would, are definitely in the Queen of Cups energy. And you try to nurture this. I feel like for a long time, you could have even tried to nurture the, this person from getting their karmic justice for fucking you over. How crazy is that? Definitely could be Libra vibes. Either you or them. Look, my cards are all over the place. Sorry, guys. I'm all, you know, I'm getting into the reading child. I'm leaning and everything else. But listen... You heard me though? Because this person is in, they're feeling anxious about their investment. So for some of you guys, they invested in another person over you and now they can't sleep. This person, the person that they invested in might be fucking, maybe they don't come home at night. Maybe a person don't come home at night. This could also for some of you guys be that hater that we, the hater right here. That could also be the hater, you know, for a lot of us. You know, like I said, this person could be talking smack about you. And this person thinks that then their, their person, whoever this third party, whatever is, or this is your ex, whatever, take it. You know, take it where it resonates. This person that they done, your ex or whatever, done yap their mouth to somebody and now they don't like you. Remember that person, right? Yeah, this could be them that, you know, karma just had to be served on them too because they really thought it was a game. Either way, go, somebody was nurturing a situation and you knew it wasn't right. But 
then you started to feel the burdens in your dreams because you see somebody is is in a heavy burden trying to walk in your dream world and that's the fucking that's the truth because you're in the star energy look somebody they're definitely trying to spy on the uh on the star here yeah somebody heavy aquarius energy you could be like you have aquarius placements or this person or but either way it goes you're in a real carefree energy a fluid like energy you know um but you're very these people are fucking inspired by you and they want to work with you but they feel like this could even be somebody who tried to work with you before like maybe on a project for some of you guys or at the job or something and they're all in their fucking feelings because they felt like you passed them up for like i don't know some of you guys didn't want to be in the group with this motherfucker and no, i'm just playing but they're focusing on the negative they're having a lot of remorse somebody's really having a lot of remorse about how they treated you though that's definitely what's going on here yeah Somebody got too curious when it came to this spell work too. And that was the that was the downfall of them. And now people are refusing to work with them like you know, no more offers. People are refusing offers with them and that's 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 something was exposed by your fucking ancestors, 10 of, 10 of pentacles cuz you know, there's a lot of deeds and trust funds. I see look at that. We got deeds and trust funds with the financial support. Yeah. Yeah, so it's, it's giving inheritance, big house, like foundations could be started. I don't know, like you could be doing some sort of nonprofit work. You could be, um, some of you guys could even be, what's the word? Community service and stuff like that. But I definitely see um, the scales are being balanced within your favor here. And we got the Virgo card. Look, we got the um, the hermit mode because you, you're you discovering your gifts, you know? You're figuring out your higher self and your soul, how your soul works and stuff like that. Yeah, this is beautiful energy. Somebody's a Virgo here. Um, but yeah, whoever this Virgo energy is, you're about to get good news about balance being restored into um, with you and this person. But I feel like, yeah, and the balance is not what you think it is, though. I hate to say it like that because, look, we got the Temperance card. Then we got the King of Pentacles followed right by the Devil card. Now, that could be just informing us this person is a Capricorn because the Devil card is Capricorn, especially with the King of Pentacles. But this person is way too focused on the material things. And that could be the downfall of them here um, because, yeah, they're trying to make a break for it away from being your masculine here. Yeah. Um, or away from this um, this leading authority. Like, I don't know. Because whoever this is, like, they know that they have the... Okay, so they also want security. I don't know what's holding this person back. I do. It's like, oh, that's what it is. So this person doesn't have the range. They don't have the range to, like, fuck with you. Like, I told... Remember earlier, Spirit said earlier, some for some of you guys or somebody, like, that's jealous of you. They're just jealous. I don't think I got to, like, get in on that. But, like, whoever that person is, they're jealous of you because you're a, you're a star. You shine bright, like... It's not just them. Like, for some of you guys, this person could be used to getting all the spotlight. And you also get spotlight naturally without trying. And, like, that can bother them for some of you guys. But, yeah, if that's who this person is, then, yeah, they're trying to run off on the plug for real. Because, bitch, they, they know they can't fuck with you. Like, they know that even whatever deities they work with and all that, they know even with that, they better run off. Because they don't even know you like that. But they know that you you ain't to be fucked with because they're like they're looking at you and they're like mm, you know their life is too good right now like things are too stable and they're moving forward they're moving forward out of these little prisons that they set up these fucking look because you're in the queen of Co queen of swords I, people try to lie to you listen i can see a lot going on here so let me go and shut this down because maybe i'm getting too long here but listen whoever this person is that's too focused on their money 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 Ask yourself or ask them why money is all you have to offer. Like, remember, I heard a saying that says, I was once so broke, I met a man. I met, nah, I was once so broke, never broke, never claimed that. I met a man that was once so broke. All he had was his money. Yep, yeah, so whoever that is who thinks that they can, whoever this person is that thinks they can buy their way through every room, you're their karma. Yep. And balance is being restored. And they're also telling you, don't even lose your cool on this mother. Don't do it. If you already did, cool. Keep fake smiles on your face. Look, keep that fake smile on your face. It's for some of you guys, this could be your baby daddy or somebody that you're still dealing with, whatever. Doesn't have to be, but yeah. Keep a fake smile on your face so that your emotions aren't up and down, but yes. Yep, it's looking good though, yeah. But either way, they are definitely tripping on you and they're definitely sending you a lot of energy, but... 
I think they got some other drama going on. And now you could be in a new expecting, a new beginning. Look, you're in a new beginning with somebody else or this is what's like literally right around the corner for you. So like you're in straight fertility mode, like you're in empress mode, like you're leaving the past behind. You're not dealing with nobody who's un like um, unstable. You know, nobody who's going to be a hater. Yeah, nobody who's running away from you because they're making a lot of bad choices. If somebody keeps ghosting you or doesn't know what they want, it's because they're making bad choices and that's a them thing, okay? And it's like, we don't understand sometimes that like, again, self-love comes first. Like, you will literally hold up a blessing sometimes. You know, you have to spoil yourself. Do what's best for you. Don't, um, don't get me wrong. Work stuff out if you feel led to do that. That's not what I'm saying. But what I'm saying is you have to, they said it, I didn't say it, Spirit said, self-love comes first. You see what I'm saying? They will test you about that shit. And they even said, spend time healing and go. They're saying everything. Look at that. Like, your team is, is like, seriously um, pushing you to get out and network. Spend more time healing. So you can spend more time healing yourself first, and then you're going to get out and network. I don't know if this is, like, at actual clubs, parties. You know, just be safe with whatever you're doing. Could be social media groups. Yeah, because people thought you weren't serious before with the sex shop. Yep. Yeah. And they try to play toxic ways with you. They try to bring toxic energy to you. Okay, look at that. Fucking player. They play a lot of games. Yeah, this must be that uh, that knight of swords. Yeah, they're into a lot of games because they're insecure. They could be insecure about where they stand in your life, where they stand in your person's life. Um, but either way, this sex shop energy is not a serious energy. Like, Okay. All right. Anything else about the sex shop? please thank you yeah somebody's faking it yeah somebody is acting like they're too fucking busy because they know that you deserve to be spoiled or they know somebody deserves to be spoiled here um that's exactly what you're about to get somebody could actually be a performer like you know but somebody's faking like i feel like somebody's gonna want to kind of somebody sorry going to set the record straight about some timeline timeline about this baby or if they have a family with someone or if something about family time it could be their family your family but or it could be people who are act like they're your family but either way salt looks like sugar so they're telling you to watch out looks can be deceiving here with this private relationship so if somebody has someone else in a private relationship situation um now hey if, if you're getting spoiled that's different you're in a good relationship if you're in a private ass relationship and you're getting real spoiled like i'm talking like not just money but like time energy like this person listens to your ideas and stuff oh and they push your they push you to the next they push you out of depression if you ever you know what i'm saying these people are, are wishing depression on you if, if you're with a person right now who spoils you in those departments oh you're good because i know i am this ain't for me this is somebody else energy this my you know this is this is definitely old energy but this could be again take this where it resonates guys yeah look at that this could like i said again with somebody got an apartment for somebody somebody that got the money who can afford it but or they want to do that man look they want to be able to run away and chill out over this person's house child i'm done uh -uh, i don't want to do this no more yep and this is what makes that person so insecure because on one hand for some of you guys this hater it's like on one hand she feels like she got or he or she feels like they got this person you know they're like oh i got them they're this you know i i I'm trying to tell themselves they hold certain places in their lives or some shit like that and then it's like uh i don't know yeah because this person is really see this player throws everybody to the trash when he when he gets done playing games you know what i'm saying but yeah and then again this is somebody you could have threw out somebody definitely got through on their ass after telling this person they were pregnant they could have fell out yeah I don't know. Somebody's pregnant here. I don't know. Again, this could be somebody for a small select few of you. I gotta tell you, yeah. So whoever this person, some of you guys, it's a, it's somebody, somebody that's spoiled here. This could be you or the third party or something. Somebody's spoiled here, and they could have even got pregnant by this by the person that we're speaking of. They could have got pregnant by this person and then been like, oh, um. I'm pregnant and then your person or whoever this person is because I don't think this I don't know if this is your person this could be your ex person but either way it's a drama it's you know whatever this drama is going on whoever this person with this drama they could have somebody pregnant or they could have somebody that they're really like pouring a lot of life into maybe they're like selling a dream like they're gonna be in a relationship with this person so now the, the other person is applying a pressure to your person so then 
now they're trying to protect themselves from your person because your person could be like this person whoever this whoever the, the masculine is is like spending money on the other person and so now that the person's getting pregnant somebody's unsure about that wow okay any final messages yep arguments yep somebody got really really checked in this argument and now they're falling apart because they're understanding that this motherfucker ain't nothing but a hungry a hungry money hungry person who ain't who don't care see also with chill out it's like this person is just smoking chilling they're like i don't give a damn <laughs> they won't argue with them or nothing they're just like listen i'm about to argue with you you better check yourself like and that person is now the the, the other <laughs> the third party is passing the fuck out she's like no i'm not trying to be a bitch but that's true because she thought whoever this icky ass hater ass energy they thought that this, they thought they could argue their self into their box like this you know how like people would be like oh i got a box you check all these boxes for me like they thought they were gonna check the box as if like no now they're fucking falling apart because this person don't care nothing about money just like glorilla said it too shout out to glorilla something about um uh she said i can't even think of it right now because I'm, I'm channeling but she said something about like um you giving him a chance he might do you worse something like that that's not exactly what she said but it's to that extent and it's like yeah you over here trying to like get th this whoever this person is hater she over here he or she try, over here trying to give your ex person a chance and you're like look you're like girl run sir run this person ain't ready and they done you know did xyz to me but you see what I'm saying? The reason why I'm even speaking on this person is because they're showing up in your energy and they're showing up a lot. And it's because they have this false idea of who they think you are because they're a divination abuser and they they abuse their relationship with the spirit. You don't do that. You're very covered and protected by your spirit team because you work with them as an even give and take. You know what I mean? And so you understand what it takes to work for the light. You have to be respectful of all beings, but protect yourself at the same time and pick a side. But bitch, yes, so... Whoever this hater is thought that wanted to argue down why they were worthy to be with this person. But your person was like, uh-uh, I'm focused on this money right now, doing them worse than they ever did you. And now they're fucking falling to pieces. And I don't know, even this money agreement that this person had with your person, that's over with. Yep, because somebody, and so whatever happened, I feel like if somebody broke a promise with money, that it could have been like, oh, well, they put them in their place because somebody was sleeping around. Somebody could have slept with your man here. But somebody's definitely promiscuous and they have a lot of secret relationships going on. But this person is so damn chill. You can never read their energy. And they want to set the record straight. It's like, motherfucker, what are you going to tell me? I know that you messy, okay? All right, well, all I know is you're very protected and the synchronicities are in the way. Yeah, this player is going to try to come back in and spoil you. But child, they into games, okay? Bye.